Over the last four years, we have seen this UCP government cut funding in health care. During one of the worst health care crises we have seen uh, in generations, they decided that was the time to rip up contracts with doctors, threaten health care workers with layoffs and wage cuts, and roll back funding in health care. And now, on the eve of an election, they want everybody to throw them a party because they put a bit of extra money back into our health care. You know what? Albertans are going to see right through it. We're still well behind where we should be. And more to the point, the quality of care that Albertans can count on in their health care is just not up to par. It is not acceptable that people have to wait 45 minutes for an ambulance. It is not acceptable that young families have to drive hours for uh, uh, delivery and for obstetric care. It is not acceptable that people go into the ER and literally wait over a day to get a bed. Um, these kinds of things uh, just cannot be allowed to go on. And we have whole cities across this province where people cannot find a family doctor, where there's not one single family doctor um, actually taking new patients. So Alberta's NDP has done a lot of work consulting with frontline health care providers, consulting with physicians, consulting with patients, consulting with experts, and we are very proud uh, just a few or two, three weeks ago to have rolled out our family health team's proposal, um, which when it is finished will ensure that one million more Albertans will have access to family health care um, across this province. That is the way we fix our health care system.